Hi, Ed Goodman of Goodman and Associates Financial Law Group. Um, a lot of times when people come into our office, they say, well, what do I have to tell you? What do I have to disclose? Can I include this in my bankruptcy and not include something else in the bankruptcy? And what we have here is what I call the prime directive because I'm a Star Trek fan. But really, this, the prime directive here is you list all your income, all your assets, and all your debts no exceptions. That includes monies that might be owed to relatives and it includes all your assets, be they cash under your pillow or cash in a bank account or cash in a checking account, whatever. You know, most people are afraid that, oh, if I do that, I'm going to lose all that. Uh, the fact is, is that it's very rare that anybody gives up any property in a Chapter 7 bankruptcy. Uh, there are statutory exemptions under the bankruptcy code that are likely to protect all of your property. Uh, it might be one-tenth of one percent of the cases that we file, and we file thousands of them, in which a person actually gives up some property. So you shouldn't be afraid of somebody coming to your house and inventorying your property and uh, you know, taking any property from you ultimately in a bankruptcy case. In fact, the likelihood of that is very, very slim. Uh, that you would ever give up any property. So if you'd like to know how this works, give us a call. The number's on the screen below. We'll be glad to set up a no-obligation consultation for you, which means you can come into the office, meet with uh, me or one of our other attorneys, and we will be able to assess your situation, tell you if we can help you, how bankruptcy works, what chapter you should file in, the costs and the process. And when you leave here, you'll have an understanding of how we can protect you.